my channel if you're new here my name is Bailey and I wasn't going to vlog today I was like I'm just gonna take the day off and I'm not gonna post on Wednesday but then I had a couple things come up and I was like you know what I think it'd be fun to vlog those things so today's just gonna be another dog mom vlog day in the life type situation um yesterday I actually bred Indy that video is coming soon and then today I'm also breeding her again so might show a clip of that maybe not but we are doing that today um i was just editing a video that i have to get to my team for a brand deal that needs to be approved for on like the next video so i was getting a lot of work done this morning and i just didn't think i was gonna have time to vlog but here we are so if you're new here and you enjoyed today's video make sure you get a thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below it means the world to me when you guys subscribe to my channel i've just got this cute little like set on today even though I'm like so pale I actually really need to go to the tanning bed today so that's another thing I might do I don't recommend laying in the tanning bed but you know what girls gotta get some sun we're going to the beach soon so I need some sun so I want to show you guys a few things first ignore the coke I've been drinking but I was out of town yesterday bringing Indy and Matt got me these gorgeous flowers look at how pretty they are they're just starting to bloom freaking adorable he's the sweetest and then Part of my bonfire order came in, you guys. So my merch is here, at least my first order of merch. So super excited. So I need to prop you guys up and show you guys. I wanted to do it on camera with you guys. That's why I decided to vlog today. Let's see. I'm so excited. Okay. So I did end up ordering, this is really exposed, sorry. I did end up ordering like three or four different more orders. Like I've got four packages I think coming. So first things first, this is the first time I'm seeing it. I need a better setup. Like this isn't tall enough. Okay, that's not much better, but it is better. Okay, so first got the crew neck that I got. Oh my God, it looks so good. It's adorable. Okay, watch out. The dogs are, I don't want y'all on it. So the crew neck, I got the forest green crew neck. Hey dudes. There's the cute little back. I'm freaking obsessed. Indy Jagger, it's you. You're on a hoodie. Look Indy. Uh, get down. <laughs> Look Indy, you're on a hoodie. Super cute. I'm obsessed. I think it looks really good. Feels good, super soft. And then this, I believe it's Matthews. So I got him a long sleeve Gildan like shirt. So he got the navy. So it's hey dudes. And then it's got this on the back. Oh, love it. I got a size large and everything too, by the way, because I love larges. And then this is my favorite it's the comfort colors oh my god i love comfort colors and this oh my god this looks so good on the blue you've got the hated and then you've got the design on the back and i'm obsessed with like their little name tags on their colors that say their name oh so cute so i'm probably gonna wear this or the i'm so glad i got a large i love large t-shirts so it's so cool to hold this and like no, it's mine and like I've already got some people like showing me themselves like wearing it and it's just amazing so comment down below let me know if you got your merch and if you're in love with it I'm super in love with it and I'm planning on launching a another design probably within the next like two or three months or so maybe the beginning of summer and I've got the idea already in my head I just need to get my designer to design it so I'm super duper excited for that but yeah I just want to come on here and show you guys the merch like I got. So I think my order for the Rosemary Doodle shirts just shipped and then I am getting another order of the Hey Dudes I believe and possibly the Rosemary Doodles. I ordered like four different times because I ordered my grandparents um, one. So yeah I'm super duper excited. So I'm gonna go try like put on one of these and I'll show you guys. All right I just put the crew neck on. I've got like biker shorts and like I should do earlier this biker shirt on but i wanted to throw the hoodie on this is the softest hoodie ever i'm so excited at how comfortable it is so 
you got your hay dates, and then your the back of it. Let's see if I can get twisted around and show you guys. So, super excited, super duper comfy. Ignore my mirror. I really need to clean my mirror today and clean house. So we'll see if that's in this vlog. I also need to grocery shop. About to actually order groceries now, but look at this. Hey dudes. Hey dudes. It's so exciting to actually like have merch. So thank you all for your support on it. Can't wait to see you guys all in it. And I'm going to go and I believe order groceries online. <music> Alright guys, so it's a little bit later and I have ordered my groceries and I also sent off the video that I needed to get approval for. So that sent off, so two big to-dos that I really need to do today. Um, now I'm taking Indy over to the other stud that we're breeding, so we're dual siring her litter. So you will already have seen it because I'm going to post it on Instagram probably today as long as it's successful. If not, it'll just be with Oliver. Um, but the breeding video is coming soon as well, so stay tuned for that. But yeah, we're gonna go get in the car, go over to Briggs, and then I'm gonna go pick up the groceries because they're supposed to be done around like 1.32. So I'm hoping by the time I get done with this and all that, they'll be ready to be picked up. And then I'll probably do like a little grocery haul for you guys. So I'm off and I'll catch you guys once I probably pick up groceries. I might put a quick little clip of Indian Briggs in this video, but you'll have to stay tuned for the like breeding video for all the behind the scenes. All right, guys, I'm sitting outside food line now waiting on my pickup order. I got pizza for lunch. I was starting to feel nauseous and I'm honestly still feeling that way. I'm not feeling the best. So I really need to get some food in my system, but gotta wait obviously on this so hopefully they'll be out soon with my order then once we get home I'll be able to show you guys what I got for the week what I'm planning on cooking for the week and then eat my pizza okay that's a lot better I've got to hurry because it's almost two o'clock and the sky's getting dark and it's supposed to start pouring rain. So I need to let the dogs out, but I wanted to show you guys a grocery haul and kind of what I've got planned for this week as far as meals. Let me get my things here. You're not going to see a lot of meat or anything in this like haul because we have a lot of frozen chicken in the fridge that we're working our way through. So I'm going to do teriyaki chicken and rice, lemon pepper chicken, broccoli and rice, barbecue chicken, mac and cheese and green beans, tortellini soup and tacos. So that's kind of what we got planned for this week. So I'm just gonna go through all this while I put it up. So, ugh. great. Naturally, we've got Sundrop. I am a Sundrop aholic. It's the best drink in the South. So I'm gonna put these two up and I put one in the fridge. Also got two gallons of milk because my husband Loves whole milk, number one, ew, which I do use it for cereal every now and then, but he loves whole milk and he goes through a ton of it, so I get two gallons a week. I got toilet paper as well, because we were out. And then I got Cheez-Its, they didn't have the coming on yet, so we got white cheddar, the thin and crispy tortillas, some tortillas, the green beans, pickles, I'm like a pickle obsessed person. And then we love this stuff for our teriyaki and chicken, or teriyaki chicken and rice. This is like the best kind. So these things go under here. That fridge, these are gonna go over here. Then I've got strawberries for me and my yogurt in the mornings. My yogurt for the mornings, I get the Chobani Greek yogurt and vanilla and I put dark chocolate cluster granola and strawberries on it, so good. I get these packs of rotisserie chickens 
or rotisserie chickens. Pack of rotisserie chicken. Matt takes it to school and he'll put it on his Caesar salads for lunches or I'll make wraps out of it. Broccoli because we love making broccoli as a side. And I swear I told them to like keep me a pound and a half and there's no way. Sorry, my phone is blowing up. There's no way this is like a pound and a half of broccoli. Then I've got some heavy whipping cream for my tortellini soup. The Caesar salad kits, Matt, my husband loves these. He eats them for lunch. That's like his go-to lunch. And then just a pack of ground beef for our tacos. And then lastly, we've got this roasted chicken. Rice only we eat this with just chicken, obviously, for meals. Mac and cheeses for meals. Lucky Charms, our favorite cereal. We're not healthy people, can you tell? We're actually children. Fruit roll ups and gushers. I like fruit roll ups, but I like gushers and fruit roll ups. Having a husband, I feel like it's like having a kid, so. More Cheez Its, again. We got white cheddar. He didn't even give me an option. He just kind of gave me a different flavor. We normally get the hot and spicy and they're so good. Some teriyaki sauce for our teriyaki chicken. Some salsa for when we have tacos. And lastly, we were out of three of our most used seasonings. So I got some garlic powder, lemon pepper seasoning, and onion powder. So I'm gonna finish putting this up and then we're gonna let the dogs out and then I'm finally gonna get to eat my pizza. And I ate a piece in the car waiting for groceries because I was so hungry. So that's my grocery haul for the day. All right guys, everyone's outside. We're going to use the potty, no willow. Use the potty and play with sticks. <laughs> no ma'am, good girl. Play with sticks for a little bit before the rain starts. I don't know if you can see like how dark it is and like over there and it's just dark all around. So it's supposed to start raining at two, I believe. So it's 156 now. So I don't think it'll start right at two, but it's definitely supposed to rain some for the rest of the day. So let's get our energy and zoomies out and then finally I'll be able to eat. All right guys, dogs have been let out and I'm taking a break to eat my pizza and watch some Just Conti. All right guys, I finished my lunch and it is thundering really loud. I don't know if y'all can hear that and it's starting to drizzle, but I thought I would take the chicken, some lettuce that we have left over that's like old into their coop and then also gather some eggs before it starts storming since we're probably not going to later or be able to later due to the storm. So we're also planning on potentially, it's starting to rain, I need to hurry. We're planning on potentially moving the coop and doing some more things with the chicken. So comment down below if you guys wanna see that, but I've gotta hurry because the storm's a brewing. Bam. It's really starting to rain, so I need to hurry. Okay, hello chickens. All right, guys, it's starting to rain, but I filled up one of their food things. And I need to watch out. And they've got some lettuce. Walk that up. Go over here. Oh, it's really starting to rain. I need to hurry. All these chickens are sitting on their eggs. All right, guys. As you saw, I just collected some eggs and fed the chickens real quick before the storm. So it is raining now, we're getting started. So I am going to just get some work done on the computer and chill out. The dogs are freaking out because they can see my grandparents' dogs. So they're like freaking out over it. But yeah, like I said, we're planning on moving the chicken coop, possibly doing some raised garden beds and stuff. So if that's something you guys would want to see, let me know down below in the comments and I can kind of vlog that stuff for you too. But 
I'm gonna get off here. Oh my god, I just saw lightning. It's lightning, and I'm gonna go run my grandparents' dog off so he can get home before the storm, huh? All right, guys, I'm not really sure where the last clip I filmed left off at, but it's like four o'clock now. I've been sitting down doing some emails, some paperwork, editing, contracts, sending out emails, all sorts of different fun things. But I am going to, I don't even know what now. Like, oh, there's Matt. Your hair looks crazy. Matt finally got home from work and I need to talk to him about a few things. His face. What face did you just make? Do it again. Do it again, make your face. <laughs> so I'm gonna go chat with him and then catch up with you guys a little bit later. All right guys, Chef Matt whipped us up some teriyaki chicken. Some white rice. What was that? <laughs> and then we put, where is it? Oh, there it is. We put this sauce on it. It's the best. So, bon appetit. All right, guys, today is the next day. I'm wearing my t-shirt that I got yesterday, my merch. And I'm not sure if I'm going to post this vlog or not. We'll see. But I figured I would at least hop on here and try to finish it. So if I did go to edit it, I could possibly use it. Um, basically, I woke up today and just been getting some stuff down around the house. Some computer work. And now I am going to take the dogs on a walk. It's actually supposed to be like 80 degrees today. So really pretty day. Um, I've got my Boho and Bark walk bag. Let me take it off so I can like show you guys. So my friend Allie got me this bag um, for my birthday, but basically it's like a dog walking bag. So you've got a strap. Um, it's got a belt loop so you can take it off like this and wear it around your belt but or your pants. And I mean, I never really do that. So I always use the strap. It's got this little thing right here. I always normally put Harlow's like e-collar remote in here. It's got a little zipper. So if you're out walking, you could put things in it like your keys or something got the little treat pouch and it's actually nice because it like cinches closed so you can keep like the treats falling out um and then on the back it's got a place for dog poop bags i always put my treats in a little dog poop bag actually and stick it down in there um so it doesn't get the bag really nasty because sometimes i'll do like like today's turkey like turkey meat so i got turkey in there i'll do like treats and that way the dust and stuff the bag itself doesn't get really dirty so i'll leave this link down below i possibly have a coupon code i'm not sure but i'll look and see i believe at one point i did for this brand boho and bark um but yeah really nice if you need a good like walk bag for your dog highly recommend and yeah i'm about to take the dogs walking and real quick before i do take the dogs walking i want to insert this clip someone sent me this on instagram and it's their dog watching our youtube channel what are you doing harlow and literally it's like the best video ever and i just love seeing your guys's like dogs reactions to the vlog and i just had to include this so this is mr buck reacting to watching our youtube so roll the clip <laughs> Alright guys, so as you saw, it was literally the cutest thing. Probably one of the best reactions I've ever seen. Let me guys know down below if your dogs freak out when our vlogs come on. It's so funny and sweet to know that not only do you guys enjoy our videos, but so do your little furry friends. So yeah, I'm about to go on a walk with the dogs and then probably catch up with you guys here in a second and then end this video. I had previously ended this vlog and my hair is crazy, but the mail truck came. So I'm going to pop this in real quick, but the rest of my merch came. So I'm super thrilled with how this looks. So this is one of the Rosemary Doodles tea. And then back design. Freaking obsessed. I love this charcoal color. And then I got black long sleeve 
Rose and Reed Doodles. This will be like what I wear when I go places for the brand. The black on this looks super awesome. And honestly, I'm very, very, very pleased with the quality of this, like these shirts. I didn't know how well the Rose and Reed would look on shirts as much as like the Hey Dudes looked, but honestly, I'm thrilled. And then I just got light gray Rose and Reed Doodles. That. And then lastly, I got a hoodie. So I'm pretty sure this gray one is for Matt. Um, I think one of the gray ones are for Matt to have. And then just another crew neck in gray, Rose and Reed Doodles. And then these crew necks from Bonfire, you guys, are so soft. And then just my logo. Mm, I love it. I'm so excited. Turned out so well. And then my Nana's came as well. I got her a Rose and Reed Doodles and then a Hey Dudes one as well. My hair. Whew. And then I just want to show you guys, I also got some things from Lululemon. So I got just this Lululemon fanny pack to use this summer to like carry my stuff around and just have because I don't carry a purse around. I really only ever carry like my keys, my phone, lipstick, things like that. So I really don't need a big pocketbook and this is just so convenient just to grab when I'm running out the door. So I got this and a lot of people have it and really like it. So decided to get my hands on that and then I got another pair of my favorite blue lemon shorts i have a blue pair um but i wanted a black pair because you can't go wrong with black i was looking for their like blue lemon align um what is it biker shorts but they didn't really have any so i was kind of disappointed but i went ahead and grabbed my favorite shorts and these are the i think it's the hottie toddy yes the hottie toddy short i get mine in the four inch line and I mean, these are short, like they're short, but they come in two and a half too. But like I said, I, oh, oh, I'm stepping on dogs. <laughs> I get mine in the four inch and I find that it's a lot more just, you know, age appropriate. I know I'm not like super old or anything, but I'm not here to also like show half my butt to the public either. So I got those, like I said, they're the hottie hot LR short four inch line. Really like these. Um, so even though Little Lemon is quite pricey, I find it well worth it, honestly. Like, it's just so good. So that's my little haul, all my different merch and the little Little Lemon items. So I just was in the mood to treat myself the other day and I did. So I'm gonna throw all this away and in the vlog. All right, guys, I just finished walking the dogs. They're very tired and now I am making some edits to the video I edited and sent to the brand yesterday. They had a couple different changes. So I have to make those changes and then I'm gonna re-upload it. And then I really need to start editing this video because this video is supposed to go up today. And here I am. I don't know, it might not even be a good video, but I don't really have much to vlog these days because I guess now I'm gonna go on a rant. So let me get set up for my rant. Basically, what I was saying is I'm going to go on a rant because this vlog, I feel like it's all over the place and it's really boring and I'm not really doing much but just showing you guys my basic life and I don't really do a lot. Like, especially when we don't have puppies, like life can get kind of boring. Like I'm working on my behind the scenes project. I'm working on a few different things like YouTube, like I've got videos going up and I don't know. I just feel like my day-to-day -day life is really boring so I feel like I've been in a really big video slump lately. Like... You know, I'm just like, I don't know. I just feel like my YouTube channel is just really stalled right now because I don't have the kind of content that I necessarily would want to create because I don't have puppies. I don't know. I guess I'm feeling just very uninspired, un like, like I'm boring you guys and like I just don't have anything to film. So it's like, do I film like what I've been doing the last two days and just film a bunch of random crap of my life and post that or do I just not post at all? Like, right now during this season of, like, waiting for puppies, do I only post once a week? Or do you guys still want to see twice a week? Like, do you guys like these random, like, just taking you guys along with me for my day? Like, are these interesting to you guys? Do you enjoy them? Like, I just don't want to be putting out content just to put out content. I want it to be stuff that you guys genuinely enjoy. And some of you might just enjoy watching me literally go about my day. But some of you might not. And I get a reason a lot of you are here is for the dogs and for the puppies and... 
there's like a time where we don't have puppies right now. So I just feel very confused on what I should be doing with this channel right now. And very, I guess, just stumped and just not feeling my best. And why did they just do that? What was that, y'all? Like, there's nothing even out there. I don't know. I just feel very, very bleh about this right now and this channel and just... I don't know what to do so that's kind of my rant i guess today like i'm just not feeling inspired lately and i feel like i don't really know what to film for you guys and what you guys would want to see or enjoy and i don't know i'm just kind of feeling defeated lately so that's kind of how i'm feeling but i need to edit this video and get it back set to the brand i really need to edit this video so i guess i'm going to end it and just edit it and see if it's even worth posting i don't even know if it will be but yeah, I'm just kind of feeling down and out about it lately. So leave me some comments down below on things you'd like to see. If you like these kind of videos of me just taking you about my day randomly and sharing with you guys just genuinely my normal life. Like this is what I do when I don't have puppies. Like it's nothing extravagant. It's just kind of casual and chill. And yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you guys want to see. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below. I promise you guys more fun content's coming. We've got the breeding indie video coming up. Um, we'll be taking Indy for an ultrasound later, like at the beginning of May, that video is coming up. Possibly two new additions to the program, those kind of videos coming up. So definitely some exciting things coming. But for now, it's just kind of dull, I feel like. But I love you guys. Thank you so much, as always, for watching this video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye, dudes.